how can I use SNTC to prepare for an iOS upgrade? SmartNet Total Care can help you prepare for an iOS upgrade by providing much of the information you need, including the amount of available memory, installed at location, and more. This can save you time compared to doing it manually. In a scenario where a network does not have SmartNet Total Care, the customer will need to manually log in and record the details at every step. This is cumbersome and time consuming. The activities include determining the iOS version for each router, confirming the physical location of each router, confirming the minimum required memory on the chassis, confirming PCMCIA or flash memory availability and size. With SmartNet Total Care, the customer can get either most or all of the information you need in a report obtained with just a few mouse clicks. Let's see how easy it is to use SmartNet Total Care. First, I'll show you how to get the information you need through the SmartNet Total Care portal. Then, I'll show you how to generate a report with the information. Log in to the SmartNet Total Care portal and select the Inventory tab. Click on the Router segment of the chassis pie chart. Select the segment of the pie chart that contains the appropriate model family. Find the specific router you're interested in and select the blue arrow icon to see the details. To see the hardware and software details on this router, click on the blue arrow icon. Here you can see the hardware details, including install flash and memory. You can also see which version of iOS is installed. You can get this information for all devices in your network in a downloadable report. From this screen, you can go back to the Categories screen and then export either as a PDF or Excel spreadsheet. The report will be available after a few minutes in the My Reports tab. The report shows the information that was shown in the portal. On some Cisco devices, such as a Catalyst 6500, or Catalyst 7600, you will need to find the amount of memory in the supervisor. Let's see how to do that. Using a terminal window, log into the device. Use remote command switch show version to see the amount of installed memory on the supervisor and the amount of flash memory available. There are more use case videos available on the SmartNet Total Care Support Community and on the Smart Services YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.